Welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to cover the reimbursement portion in the existing run row section in the Argus Excel model. There are three reimbursement methods built in, in this model. Triple net, fixed amount, and the base year stop. Triple net reimbursement means the tenant pays the expenses of the property. Fixed amount means the tenant pays a fixed amount for the expenses regardless of the total expenses incurred. For example, the tenant and the landlord agrees that the annual fixed amount reimbursement of $10,000. The first year total expenses of the properties are $12,000. Then the tenant pays $10,000 and the landlord pays $2,000. The second year total expenses of the property increased to $14,000. Then the tenant still pays $10,000 and the landlord pays $4,000. The tenant pays the fixed amount of $10,000 throughout its lease term. Base year stop is another reimbursement method where the landlord pays all expenses of the property in the first year of the lease term. This amount is also called expense stop. The tenant starts paying for the amount exceeding the expense stop in the second year. For example, the first year expenses of the property are $8,000 and the landlord pays all of them. The second year expenses of the property are $9,000. Then the landlord still pays $8,000 while the tenant pays the remaining $1,000. As the triple net is the most commonly used reimbursement method these days, I will select zero in the reimbursement field for NBC Marketing Services. The zero stands for triple net. And I copy it down for the rest of the tenant except the last one. I will use the fixed amount for the last tenant. I click the fixed amount button. A message pops up saying fixed amount reimbursement is not selected. So I will go back to select the fixed amount as the reimbursement method. Click the fixed amount button again. A window called fixed amount pops up. We are probably already familiar with this window as we went through its function in the existing run row section video. This window works the same way as the run road window. The number of the white boxes also matches the length of the lease term. I'm going to say the fixed amount is $10 per square foot per annum. Copy down across, click Save. As you can see, I don't need to input the reimbursement method for the four empty suites. Let's go to the Annual Cash Flow Summary tab. I can see the revenue from the existing run row has shown up. I have finished the reimbursement portion of the existing run role. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.